COVID-19 has forced changes to how we celebrate just about every holiday, but there's no stopping the power of love. Well, they're trying to stay safe and, uh, you know, not have to come into the shop. And uh, so and we're, we're trying to make sure everyone's safe here, too. Floral shops are flooded with orders for Valentine's Day. At Remen Heights Florist in Manchester, workers are busier because of the pandemic, with more people turning to online orders and deliveries. We're not turning no one away. You know, um, we're here until, uh, you know, late nights and uh, we're still answering that phone and people are loving it. We can do out the back door into the trunk. We can go out the front door, curbside pickup or do local deliveries too. True Confections, Candies and Gifts in Concord has already sold 600 chocolate covered strawberries with another 10 dozen arriving Saturday. We, we may be running out of berries pretty quick. <laughs> Fudge and candy are also big sellers. People know chocolate is a way to their Valentine's heart. It's hard to really determine how much of an impact COVID is having. I'm sure it is having some impact, but our numbers uh, so far for this holiday are up 25 or 30 percent from last year. And in this time of separation, it's a chance for people to show their loved ones they're thinking of them. That's what it's all about is just putting a smile on someone's face, you know.